What's up, people? Gumi got here back at episode 2 of my Pokemon Black Tier Randomized Nuzlocke. I hope you all had a wonderful day and ready to start this episode. So, in the last episode, we left off with a Stoutland and a Magikarp. I didn't do any off camera training. It's not really necessary in the beginning of the game. So, let's take a look at the team. Uh, so, let's see. Uh, we got the Magikarp. It's level 10 now, which is pretty good. Uh, and, like, I hope I hope I can get to level 20 and, like, really, like pretty quickly in this episode. Uh, and, you know, let's, uh, let's see. So, uh,. Alright, so first thing we gotta do is, uh, I think we gotta go back and uh, we gotta battle the first gym. And it shouldn't be that hard. The first gym isn't really that hard most of the time. So let's just, let's just get into it. Uh, okay, actually no, I think we have to battle Alder first, right? Oh no, we have to battle his, uh, or, like his students. Alright. Once again, I hope you all had a wonderful day. And let's do this. Okay. So it's good, because I can get a little bit of XP from these uh, trainers. Because right now I'm a little bit low on levels, kind of. Like I think uh, I think uh, like the, the 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 gym will be like level 16. I'm not really sure. I actually it might be like level 12. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, let's uh let's battle these trainers, and then let's get let's get on with the episode. Okay, vanilla. Okay, this shouldn't be that bad. Uh, what level are you? All right, 10. That's not that bad. Uh, I I, like, I guess I could stay with Magikarp, but like I don't think you can really do much, right? I mean, you could arm thrust, I guess? M maybe? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna switch out. Maybe you have like a zap cannon or something, and that that could one shot, you know? Because moves are randomized according to type, but there is a chance, like a 20% chance, I think, that they can get uh, a non like a non stab move. So I think just for just in case, we just switch out. All right, let's go for chip away. It's only 10 power points because uh, I think it's it's set to the same amount of power points Crush Claw has. All right, no, no problem there. All right, Magikarp level 11. That's good. That's good. And then let's just switch out again for the XP. All right. Tropius uh, actually is pretty dangerous for Magikarp, so hopefully you don't have like Arena Trap or something. Okay. Let's see. All right, let's switch out. All right. So last episode kind of went a little bit over time. Sorry about that. Uh, at the time of recording this, the the first episode hasn't even released yet. Breaking the fourth wall a little bit. School starts like tomorrow, so I'm trying to get a few episodes recorded before I get a bit busy with school. Uh, I'm gonna be a senior uh, in like two days, uh, one day. So you know, yeah. Uh, okay, so this episode will be a little bit shorter. Uh, like like it'll be the normal length, which is 25 minutes. Right, chip away. This should one shot. I, I it's like 70 power, right? Oh my god, uh, I didn't know Tropius was bulky. <laughs> uh, you had to give like Ch I think Chobius deserves an evolution. Like it's like really bad in, in general. Even like in playthroughs, it's just a terrible Pokemon. And then competitive, it's like even worse. Like it's in ZU or like like lower than ZU. It's like untiered basically. So it's not a good Pokemon. Like I think you should just give it evolution. Maybe get rid of the Grass typing or the Flying typing and replace it with like Steel or Fighting or something. Just something to give it like an actual like niche in Pokemon. Because right now it just sucks. So, like, if you want, like, a better version of Tropius, just use Executor. So, right, Charmeleon, that's a little scary, but I think it'll be fine. So, yeah, I wish I had, like, a Water-type move, because then I'd actually use the Magic Heart, but I don't have a Water-type damaging move. So, as you can see, I still have, like, a little bit of a cold. Uh, I didn't fully recover yet, but I think I sound a little better, which is good. Alright, let's see, just don't have, oh, Bow Beam? Okay, that's not that big of a deal. I'm not sure why they would go for that. Why the, why the AI thought that was the best move. Alright, chip away. Uh, also, they heal my Pokemon, which is pretty good. Alright, 145 XP. That's nice. And then, uh, Ludicolo. Alright, switch out again. I think Magic. We, we should be able to get to the Magikarp to level 20 by the end of the episode. If not, by episode 3. So, and then we get a Gyarados, which would be nice. A Cloud 9, okay. Once again, a pretty good ability for Ludicolo. Alright, let's uh, actually let's just go for Parasong, why not? It's just, so, just just so that uh Ludicolo uh, can uh, get Oak Coat and Magikarp can get the XP. Hydro Pump, that is kind of scary actually. How much does this do? Oh, that did a lot, okay. Maybe I should switch. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it seems like Magikarp is still very, very frail. So let's just switch out and then we can get the XP. Right, low sweep. I guess I'll heal the Magikarp. I mean like, Parasong will kill it, so it's not like I'm that worried. So, I'm, I guess I might as well just let Magikarp get the KO and heal up my Pokemon. Alright. First gym is going to be a little bit scary. I just hope they don't have anything too crazy. So, was that like Supersonic? 
Okay, I think that was supersonic. All right, let's just go for like another potion and then wrap this up. Actually, in Gen 3, if you use Parasong, when they still have more than one Pokemon, they will switch out. The, the, the AI isn't that dumb. They actually know what they're doing most of the time. It's only in Gen 1 where the AI is like actually terrible. Alright, Magikarp level 12. Nicely done. Nicely done. Alright. Perfect. I just want Magikarp to learn like an actual damaging move. Alright, do you hunt Pokemon again? Please? Thank you. All right, let's go. And then we, and the metal guy is waiting outside. I don't care about these metals. I have no idea what they do. Like, okay, let's take a look. These metals, they uh, I don't, I, I'm pretty sure there's like, there's like a whole like, event thing with like these metals. I just don't really get what what the point of them are. You gave me a a first step metal, and hit metals, I guess. I I don't really know. Okay, it's not that important. Like, it's a, it's someone, I actually don't know what these metals do. But I, I'm assuming it's like for some like very specific event thing or whatever. All right, let's see. All right, let's uh. Oh, I just I just realized that we have to do the Pokestar Studios at some point in the next episode or or this episode possibly, and I'm not looking forward to it. I hate the Pokestar Studios. I find it very very time consuming for no reason. So uh, I, I was just gonna like try to get through that as like as quickly as possible. All right, let's see. All right, good, good, good. I think we should be good on healing items, but I'll buy like one more just in case. All right. Let's see. All right. I do hope this cold, get, you know, this cold uh, goes away soon, because I don't really like recording when I'm when I have a cold. All right. Aldo just casually breaks his legs. <laughs> okay. All right. Now, but uh, I don't really like recording too much when I have a cold. I don't sound that great. And uh, I just don't feel that great. <laughs> but of course, I want to get some content for you all. And I do hope by like the third or fourth episode, fifth episode, uh, this cold will be gone and I'll sound normal again. So, let's see. All right, thank you for the orange berries. And I shall go to the first gym. Okay. Oh, wait. All right, this way. Perfect. Okay. All right, I've encounter. All right, maybe I can Oko it for XP. Uh, it's a it's a furry giraffe. Okay, no, I'm kidding. Uh, it's a, actually a giraffe freak. Uh, let's see. Actually, I call the I, I call the furry giraffe sometimes. I call it a a, a, a fair giraffe just as a joke. Uh, like I, I have my friends who are like who are like my friends who are like you know they, they play Pokemon right. I always call like fair giraffe in front of them, and then they get like really upset because <laughs> like because I'm butchering the name like really badly. Honestly, I'm, I, it's it's just it's just more fun to call it that. Like furry giraffe is just too much work. <laughs> So just called giraffe egg, like giraffe egg or something like that. Just just to just to joke around a little bit. All right. Let's see what we got. All right, you give me your fresh water, right? All right. Thank you for the fresh water. Perfect. Okay. Yes, I am a challenger. Right, hopefully the mic is good. I noticed in the last episode that my uh, my volume was a little bit loud, and the game audio I should be fine. But like the my mic audio just sounds like really loud and like peaking. Uh, like like OBS like tells you when your your voice is too high when your when your volume hits like the red right. And yes, when I was looking back yesterday, my my volume hit the red like every single every single time I spoke. So right now it's in like the yellow ish. Like occasionally it hits red, but mostly it's fine. So hopefully I'm not too loud in you know, like when you when you watch my videos. So let's see. All right, ice burn. That's kind of that's kind of weird for Motris. All right, uh, let's go for chip away. All right, this should be uh pretty okay. Oh, almost Oko. Uh, this is gonna burn, isn't it? Uh, is it guaranteed chance or is it like fifty percent? I I don't really remember. It is not guaranteed. Nice. Okay, I think it's like fifty percent chance. Right, like, like, what is it? Uh, Free Shock has like a 50% chance to paralyze or something. All right. Ooh, nice. Okay, let's see. It's a Magby. Okay, I still think Magikarp can't take this down. Like, it doesn't. It hasn't learned a Water type move yet, so I can't really do anything with it. So for now, it's just there, just to soak up experience. All right. Let's see. You're level 10. Yeah, I can't really do anything. If you're like level five, I could try, but. All right. No, this talent is pretty good though. Like, if I get like a silk scarf, it could be like much better. 
And if and if abilities capitals existed in this gen. Oh come on, not the inferno. Ah, oh, that's a guaranteed burn. So that is a little bit unfortunate. All right, let's just go for the uh, extra century and it should do some pretty good damage. Okay, I have to go back and heal after this. Wake up slap that does do super effective damage, uh, but it didn't kill, which is good. And fortunately, you gave me that fresh water before, so I am going to use it. Yeah, like I could. Like, I'm healing right now. I could never do a hardcore Nuzlocke. Like, like even for people who are better at Pokemon, like United Gamer and stuff like that, they just, you know, hardcore Nuzlocke are just so challenging. Like, they like, even they have, like, trouble, like, doing that. Like, I would fail at hardcore Nuzlocke immediately. Like, uh, Dylan likes to make fun of me, like, my versus partner, for uh, healing too much in these battles. But I, uh, like, healing is, like, it's still, even when you are healing, the, the battles are still a little bit challenging. So I could, but I could never survive a hardcore Nuzlocke. Like, I would lose in like the first battle. So, do you have one more Pokemon? Oh, you have one more Pokemon. It's kind of annoying. All right, let's just uh, stay in and then go for like a extra century a few times, and I think it'll be good. It's just the Furo. Oh, well, okay. You went for Endure, which is honestly a waste of a turn since extra century was not gonna one shot anyway. So let's see, like, how much does extra century do? Like, yeah, it does like a third. Like, that is not gonna kill so let's just go for uh, oh that was the wrong move okay heat wave that's a little annoying uh, okay uh okay i had to heal here uh I, I misclicked which is not good let's just go for the potion i think we'll be fine as long as you like only go for heat wave or something weak let's see heat wave yeah okay we're, we're fine we're fine yeah furo i think furo actually learns heat wave uh and like like as an actual move uh but no one actually runs heat wave on furo Endure? Oh, stop being annoying. Alright, you know, this is why I should have, like, toxic it. <laughs> Alright, chip away. Should just bring it down to one, right? Yeah. And then, uh, you only have, like, heat wave as a move, so I'm just go for Exit Sensory. Yeah, and I outspeed. Alright. Alright. Alright, nice. We, we, got, we got through one battle. <laughs> that, that, that one battle took, like, five minutes. Alright. Alright, let's go back and heal real quick, and then, uh, I'll... I'll, I'll battle the next trainer. Do, 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 do. Okay. All right. So I think Pokestar Studios will be f f the n the next episode. So I, I don't think we have to deal with that pain this episode. But since I'm recording these back to back, I'm doing like bulk recording. I had to do Pokestar Studios in like half an hour, and I hate Pokestar Studios so much because it's so annoying. But all right, let's see. And they don't they don't even let you uh like uh what is it use your own Pokemon. So it's like what's the point? So. Okay. All right, let's go and let's go back to the gym and let's keep going. All right, so uh, I, 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 right now I'm like doing like a lot of talking. Uh, typically, like whenever I'm like when I do these episodes, I typically like only talk about the game itself. Uh, sometimes I talk about just my personal life, but try, I'm trying to find like the right balance for my commentary. Uh, Cause right now, like obviously without with like without the face cam and without like. What is it like? All I guess you could say like without like the big editing and like the intros. There's not like right now talking like commentary is like like a lot of what my channel is. So if you uh, if you have any like like you know advice on how I should like do commentary in my episodes, let me know because uh, I want to make sure I give good content for you all. All right, all right. Let's go for the chip away. Let's see, because I actually don't. I don't really talk. I don't really talk about, like much about. Oh, you got poison point. Like, I don't really talk much about like my act my life that much in these vi in these videos, cause like it's just it, you don't really see my face, so it's not like there's much to talk about. Uh, like like you know my personal life is a bit private from this channel, but I do talk about uh, my personal life sometimes, right? Like I like you guys know that I'm a like Asian, I guess. <laughs> uh, that's that's and like what I'm 17. Like th those are all things that like I talk about on this channel, like from time to time. All right, let's see. This poison is a little bit scary. All right, all right. I think I should be able to one shot, and I think I probably should outspeed. So I think we're okay. Like chip away is a pretty good move. Uh, I think Tyranitar might be able to learn it. I'm not sure about that actually. All right. I, I remember actually Black Two was like the first game that I uh, played as a randomizer. It wasn't uh, it wasn't a YouTube series. This is like in 2018, right? Uh, I did I did Pokemon Black Two as a randomizer just for fun. Cause that that was like my first randomizer ever. Like I searched up on YouTube, how to do a randomizer. Cause I was like, I thought it was super cool, how uh, other YouTubers did it, and I wanted to try it for myself. So then I looked at uh, 
on a YouTube video on how to do it, and I, I picked Black 2 in my first game. And the first time I tried it, I actually, uh, is that gonna, is that gonna kill? I, I'm not sure about that. Okay, I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Is it 12% of your health, right? That 12% of my health is like six. Okay, we're good. We're good. All right, and the, the, the toxic didn't uh, happen anyway because it was the end of the battle. So let's go back and heal one more time. Uh, anyway, uh, so that Black 2 was the first game that I randomized. It, it didn't work the first time because I, I think I did something wrong. Uh, but it was super cool once it actually worked. I remember having a lot of fun by ra with randomizing the game. I remember I had I had like a Groudon or something like that. And then like I had like a Tyranitar with Stall. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. And then I think I did my first like series sort of in like uh like 2018 sort of like 2019 ish it really depends on how you look at it because the first series with like my voice in it was like like 2020 right late 2020 but the, my first ever attempt at a series was like mid 2019 i think so it really just depends you know on how you interpret it but the point is though is that black 2 is like a, one of my favorite games right and i i, I, I played it a lot like as growing up like like I, I didn't, it wasn't like one of my first games ever because I, I was a bit too young to have played it when it came out. But once I started playing it, it was it was one of my favorites. I actually never finished this game before. Like I think I got to the the champion and I lost. Right, that was like the the black. I think it was the, that was the black two master mode or something. Right, but I ended up losing that like really quickly. Uh, and I ended up I I think I made it to the champion. And I lost there. So let's see. All right, let's see. And I think this is like the third time I played black two. So. You know, it's a lot of fun to play this game again. Right? Leech Seed, okay, that's a little annoying, but uh, I think I could probably switch out after this. Worst case scenario, I just start using Toxic to balance it out. Alright, let's go for Chip Away. Perfect. Alright, Magikarp, alright, Yamega, I think I could just... Stay in. I don't want to risk the Magikarp uh, lose uh, fainting here. Yeah, four low, low 14 is a little dangerous. Chip away might one shot. Okay, yeah, this is why I need a. Uh, this is why I need the Silk Scarf because right now I'm, I'm like falling a little short on these one hit KOs, and the Leech Seed is not helping either. So I'll switch out after this. After I take down this Pokemon, this Chip away still is in range of takedown. Oh come on, don't do this. Please don't do this. Do not do this. Come on, please. Please don't do this. Okay, good, good, good. Alright, I'll switch out after this turn and I'll get rid of the confusion and the leech seat. So. Oh nice. That was that was good XP. Okay. And then I will switch out into Oh, it's just it's just a Cincina. Alright, that's fine. Um, I might be able to take that down with uh with Magikarp. Is, is this your ace? Or is this like uh your your uh, weakest Pokemon? Okay, actually, I, this is actually the big one. I thought this is this is a small one. Okay, it's Mincino. That's the smaller version. Okay, all right. So I'll switch out. I think Chip Away should uh, one shot. All right. All right. Perfect. Okay, that was uh, that was pretty close to it. Oka. All right. Now potion. All right. I don't think that's gonna do enough. So I think Chip Away just one shots. Perfect. All right, there you go. We took down the first gym, and they play like the triumph of music too, which is nice. All right, there you go. That is good. That is good. Okay. Okay, there you go. So, Brenda, it's time for you to do a crap ton of editing again. <laughs> all right. Okay. That, all right. Let's see. There you go. The first badge. Nice. All right. All right. Oh, stun support's not bad. All right, that's a pretty good TM. All right, workup is not the actual TM, but workup probably would have been honestly. I think workup would have been better. So, all right, let's let's go. Let's keep going. I think we should be able to make it to the next city, which is nice. All right, let's heal up real quick. All right, first we gotta do this. This uh. This uh, cutscene thingy. Brick break. Ooh, that's pretty good. If Stalin can learn that, that'd be amazing. Alright. Alright, what's up, Charon? It has been two years. Yeah, so I, once again, you're going to hear me talk about 
the uh, the uh, how like Black Two and like this a good sequel and stuff like that. I like how like do like they like do like references and stuff. Cause two years ago is when Black Pokemon, the original Pokemon Black came out. So like I like I love how they do like references to like the first game and stuff, and like how uh, they always talk about like the trainer before and the trainer before is the it should be you if you played Pokemon Black. So right there you go. It's all awesome, awesome. Okay, all right. Uh, uh, Hugh, I think Hugh is, shows up too, right? Yep, there you are. I named you Dylan uh, because you know verses, I guess. All right. Oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, C gear. Yeah, I hate this thing. It doesn't actually work on an emulator. No, I'm gonna turn off. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I don't care. The stupid C gear is not necessary. Like the only thing it does is uh, like tell you the time, I guess, <laughs> which I don't need because I, I I can see it on my computer. All right, let's heal up real quick, and then we're on our way to the next city. All right. All right. So right now the magic harp is a uh, pretty decent level, which is nice. All right, let's let's keep going and then let's go to the, the next city. Oh, you have Shadow's tag? Okay, that's a little annoying. Uh, let's just go for Secret Power, I guess. How much does this do? Oh, that does like very bad damage. Okay. Uh, fortunately, my Magikarp is higher level now, so I think we should be we should be fine. But that's a that's a little bit unfortunate. So, all right. All right. Just keep going for secret power and we'll be fine. Alright, Bodo is not a big deal because you're like level like four. <laughs> so we're good. Alright, there you go. And we, got, we should get a level from this, right? Awesome. Alright, let's keep going. Alright. And then uh, we, we just go downward, right? And then that's the next route. All right, it's Bianca. Uh, what's up? All right, thank you, thank you. Let's keep going. No, I do not care. Okay. All right. Yep. Bye, bye, Bianca. I do not care. All right, let's go. All right, we're at twenty. We already were here, and then we had to battle the hiker, right? All right, we battle you. Okay. Alright, zig zig Okay, actually, I think I should be able to arm thrust this thing. So, let's see. Arm thrust, let's go for the attack. I do have speed, which is nice. Uh, how much? This does okay damage. I mean, it hit three times, which isn't bad. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess this is fine, right? Just keep going for arm thrust. <laughs> okay, arm thrust once, arm thrust twice, uh, hit two times. Mirror shot, that doesn't do. Uh, I thought that was a mirror coat for a sec. I was a little concerned. Alright, aren't dressed. Not effect spore. Oh man. Okay, it's fine. We, we took care of the uh, the, the zigzagoon, so there's no there's no issue. Alright, I actually I, I have to go back and heal now, which is a little bit annoying, but we'll be good. So. Alright, Drober. Okay, airlock. Alright, that's not a big deal. Let's just go for a chip away, and we'll be fine. Alright. Alright, let's go back and heal, and I think we can end off the episode there. We are at about the 25 minute mark. Alright, there you go, let's heal up. And then let's save here.
All right, perfect. There you go. Well, I hope you all enjoyed the episode. Make sure to stay safe. Have a nice day. Peace out.